Last weekend I had the opportunity to play the Marvel's Avengers open beta on the PS4. Going into it I had low expectations due to the overlock lack of hype but I decided to let the game speak for itself. In terms of gameplay it was actually quite fun. I got to play each hero and they were all unique and gave me a reason to play them. Thor's hits were impactful, you could really feel the hammer hit the enemies and the sound of each swing was very satisfying. Iron Man's repulsor sounded amazing and his fight was very smooth. Hulk was my favourite hero to play. He was so chaotic and you could really feel like you are just destroying everything around you. Captain America fought in a very fun way and his shield was very cool to use and hit people with. Black Widow had a very fun combat system with a grappling hook and guns. It gave me so much freedom for combos and I could play her how I wanted to. Miss Marvel was also a close contender for the most fun hero. She was dynamic and smooth to destroy enemies and the representation was awesome to see. Moving on to the story, it was very interesting and it was brought into the story very easily because of the character moments and interactions. The voice acting was really great and it really felt like the Avengers knew each other for a long time. The looting and gear system was not what I was hoping for. The best way to put it would be that it was the worst, worst version of Destiny 2's looting system and gear system. But it did the job. There were a total of 10 missions spanning 4 different parts of the world. The missions were pretty repetitive with the same objectives in most of them. Something that wouldn't be a good sign for the real game. The servers were absolutely horrible. On the first day, every few minutes they would say no internet connection while I was playing and it was obnoxious. But it was gone the next day. The lobby was annoying as I joined people who were already in the game and had to wait or leave and ready up again. There was no real way of communicating with my team aside from voice chat. A ping system would really benefit the game. More end game statistics would be nice to see how well you did in the mission. Overall, I thought it was very fun but repetitive. It had a mediocre looting system and missions, but the story is captivating enough to bring a real good amount of people to play the game. What are your thoughts? Be sure to comment and tell me what your experience was. Also, subscribe and like the video if you enjoyed it. It's free and you can always just unsubscribe from the channel. Thanks for watching. I'll see you around.